Hello, my name is Martin Schulz. I work for the development department of Škoda Auto. And today I'm going to show you new digital and simply clever infotainment system of the new Škoda Octavia. I will start with pairing my mobile phone. It's really simple solution. In infotainment system, I will choose telephone context menu. Here I will select my phone. Right now on my mobile phone, I will select the name that the infotainment system shows me. After choosing the correct one, I will confirm the pairing code. I'm given the option to synchronize my contacts. If I allow this, all my contacts are loaded into the infotainment system and then I'm given the option to use the Apple CarPlay, which is here present in the wireless version. If I select it, then both devices are connected together. At this point, I can just leave my mobile phone and start using the functions just directly from the infotainment screen. How to make personalization of the home screen? Simply by touching the tile that I do not like. I will open the edit menu. There, by clicking on the trash bin, I will delete the tile. Then, by pressing the plus button, new menu opens with all functions that are possible to be put here. In this case, I have selected car stages. Then, just by simply pressing the cross button, everything that I wanted is set here and the home screen is set. How to control the air condition? Simply by controlling the temperature, pushing the minus and plus on the bottom side of the infotainment. Or if you want some additional functions or advanced controls, you can press the Klima hard key. You can control fan speeds or air direction or just simply switching on the inner circulation. Then there are new smart features, which is called smart air condition. There you can see few icons that does everything automatically for the user. For example, cooling my feet, warming my hands or defogging windows. All simply just by pushing one button. As a next function, I'm going to show you the control center, which can be accessed anywhere from the infotainment system just by dragging down the top side of the screen to the bottom. Favorite context is open. Here I can quickly switch on or off the functions or choose my own ones by holding my finger on the function. Then this menu of favorite functions is opened. I can choose one which is favorite for me and by dragging my finger I can place it there. Then by going back the button is here and I can just start using it. How to quickly enter the car settings menu? Simply by pressing the hard key then go into the settings in the infotainment screen. There car context is opened. Here you can freely move just by doing the gesture in front of the infotainment system. And on each screen, you see the functions that correspond to the each view. Next feature that I would like to show you is choosing my own background of the infotainment screen. Simply by going into the screen setting, then the backgrounds. There are 10 of them that are pre-configured and I can just freely choose them. For example, this one, if I like it, I can close the menu just simply by going back, background is set. 